Hey guys, on today's video we're going to be updating to the latest iOS. Now this is the same thing whether you guys have an iPhone, iPad or touch, exact same instructions. Let's just go right into your settings. On your settings, your first option will say tech and design or whatever name your device is or your own name. From there, make that backup using your iCloud. If you don't have more iCloud space, don't worry. Use your computer in order to make that backup or even if you're having problems, also use your computer, iTunes, in order to make the backup and update. Anyways, for now, we're just gonna scroll down. We're gonna see general. Under general, our second option will say software update, and then this will load up iOS 14.1, which is very, very small update. So that's only 351 megabytes. Some of you might already see install instead of download. That's okay. Sometimes, depending on your settings, this could already have downloaded and all you have to do is install. So right now I'm just gonna press on download and install. It's gonna ask me for my passcode if I have one. Once I do that, then finally the download process will start. Now during the download process, if your iPhone iPad up touch turns off, it's no big deal. You guys can go ahead and keep downloading later on. However, if there is a mistake on it where it turns off in installation, then that's a problem then you're gonna have to restore it. And that's why we made that backup, just in case something goes wrong. So make sure you guys have at least 50% of your battery. Even if you guys have more than 50%, I still recommend hooking up some electricity and making sure it's charging during the way so nothing will, bad will happen. So the downloading process, since it's pretty small for most of you, it's not gonna take more than five minutes. With really slow internet, sure, this could take 10 minutes. However, for most of you, way less than five minutes, just a few seconds. And then the installation time will just defer depending which device you guys have. For now, all we have to do is just wait. Once it has downloaded, you're gonna see install now. So let's just tap on install now. It's just gonna restart. We're gonna see an Apple logo and a loading bar. So after you see the Apple logo and loading bar, it's just gonna go back into this. If you have a passcode, put it right now. And there you go. You're all done with the update. We can go back into our settings and just make sure. So we're gonna go down, general, software update and 14.1 perfect anyways that would be it for this video if you guys have any comments questions you guys can write down here in the comments area don't forget to subscribe and rate thank you